Hey, I want to do a brief intro to a concept called tetration. Now, they don't teach this in schools, so let's get into it. So, we all know what exponentiation is, right? If we have a 3 to the power of 2, all right, that's the same thing as 3 times 3, all right, which equals 9. If we have a 3 to the power of 3, all right, that equals 3 times 3 times 3, which equals 27. But now we're going to be, with tetration, we're going to be introducing the concept of a power tower. And what does that mean? Well, before we actually look at tetration notation, let's just take a look at what a power tower is. If we have a 2 to the 2 to the 2, all right, that is the same thing as 2 to the, 2 to the power of 2. 2 to the power of 2 is 4, all right? So that's the same thing as 2 to the 4, all right? And then this... It's the same thing as 16, right? So we can rewrite that as 16, right? Or 2 to the 4. Let's look at one more example. If we have 3 to the 2 to the 3, or sorry, to the 3, right? We can rewrite that as, well, 3 to the 2 times 2 is 4 times 2 is 8 to the 8. All right, and let's grab out a calculator. 3 to the power of 8 equals 6,561. So we, we can already kind of see something that power towers will do, which will, it'll increase small numbers very, very quickly. I mean, just take a look. This is just a 3, a 2, and a 3, and we got up to 6,561. All right, so let's take a look at... Um, tetration notation now. So if we have a, let's say we have a 2, and then from the 2, we have a 5, right? So this is where we're going to put the tetration. So let me write that a little bit bigger. We have a 2, and in front of the 2, we have a 5, right? That is, as we already said, is going to be, well, 2 we're going to have five twos in total, right? So that includes the base right here. So we're going to have two to the two to the two to the two. So this is going to be a very large number, right? So this equals two to the, well, two to the two to the two to the two is four, right? So then this equals two to the two to two to the four is 16, right? So then this equals, well, 2 to the 16, so 2 to the 16 is 2 to the 6,000, or no, 6, 5, 5, 3, 6, all right? And then I'm not even, I'm not going to plug this into the calculator, but I'm sure you can see that's going to be a very large number, right? I encourage you to plug that into the calculator and see what it'll be. But we can see as well, once again, with tetration, we're going from a very small number, just a 2 to the 5, to something that will be incredibly large. And what does this mean? Well, it means that tetration doesn't necessarily have, like, a load of applications in the real world. The main one is, though, is that we can rewrite very big numbers as something much smaller, right? And before I conclude, I just want to talk about some other ways the another way that people will write tetration especially on like a keyboard or something is they will have as we said we had a two right and typically people on a keyboard will write it with a carrot stick and a five if that was exponentiation we can with tetration though we write it as a two and then a double carrot stick and then a five right so thank you so much for watching let me know if you have anything to add or if there was anything else you want me to cover, have a great day.